Yo, what's going on YouTube? You're all very welcome back to another video. It is your boy Hutchie HD and in today's video guys, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be showing you all a tutorial on the Biff, um, more commonly known as the two console glitch, okay? And um, what this is going to allow us to do is it's going to allow us to purchase um, basically the high-end apartments, okay? And basically not lose any money. All right, so you're going to need to have a friend. You can you do do this with a friend, or if you like, if you don't have a, a second console, okay, you're going to need to basically have two consoles, or you can do this with a friend as well. If you, if your friend logs into your account and is willing to help you out, all right. But make sure that is a person that you trust. You know, like you trust this person a lot. Don't just give any person your de account details. All right, so um. Anyway, with that out of the way, guys, the application that I'm going to pop up on the screen right now is called Archive Router. All right, this is the application that we're going to be using. So, um, I'll have the link for the application in the description. All right, so I'm currently logged in on the Xbox One. Now, normally, you guys will know if you launch the game on another console, it will force kick you off it. All right, but we want to keep this Xbox One online because this Xbox One has the money that we want okay it has the money right so what we're going to do is we're going to click this little lock here and we're going to block our xbox one all right so our xbox one is locked right now and we're just going to basically have her just walk around in a circle we're just going to have her walking around like this and now i'm going to switch over to my xbox series x And all you want to do is just go online. Go online. Right, so I'm going to click play here instead. And what's going to happen is we're actually still online on the Xbox One. All right, normally what will happen is if you load up on like the game again on a different console, it will actually kick you off the game. But with Archive Router, you have that unique feature where you can lock the console. So... Basically, the console doesn't detect that you've launched the game on another console. So you're able to manipulate a lot of stuff by doing this. Okay, so what we're going to do right now is go online into an invite-only session. You can do this with casino chips. You can also do this with um, what I'm going to be showing you guys right now, the apartments, okay? Now, obviously, I already have the most expensive apartments, so I'm going to obviously have to trade them in to just showcase the video here okay i just want to be able to showcase you know what you can do all right now i already have the most expensive apartments so i'm gonna to have to trade them in to buy them again you know so i'll just show you guys anyway so we're after logging on here right we're after logging on now guys if you don't want to lose money okay don't buy an apartment into the last slot. Just keep the last slot empty. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go to, um, I think it's the Dynasty 8. Now, I'm obviously going to have to trade these in, all right? But what you guys would do is you just buy the most expensive apartments, all right? So we're, I'm just going to trade in all these. As you can see, like, I'm earning money right now from just earning the, uh, trading these in, all right? And buying the most cheapest ones, right? Now, I obviously don't need money, but I just want to show you guys in case you have accounts there that, you know, you want to basically just make a bit of change on, you know, if it has no money at all. Like, I have accounts on the, P or the PS5 and they're broke, you know, there's no money on them whatsoever. But, um, you know, you can, there's a lot of stuff you can do with the two console glitch. And I had a lot of requests from people asking me, you know, to showcase Beth. Um... And by all means, like, I, there's a lot of stuff that you can still do with Beth. You can fucking merge everything with Beth. You can do a lot of stuff, you know. Um, you can merge cars, everything. But basically, I just want to... All I'm doing is trading in the apartments here so that I can show you guys basically what you can do, all right? And for me to showcase this, I have to trade in every apartment here. All right, you want to keep the last one. You want to keep the last one um, when you're buying them. You want to basically keep the last one free, all right? Otherwise, you will lose money. You lose money every fucking time you do this. If you don't, if you buy into this, you're going to lose money, all right? So now, what you guys would do is you'd load online, yeah, and you'd have the money there, all right? You'd have the money there. So what you would do is you'd go into Dynasty, and you go here and you'd buy 
basically the most expensive apartment, right? You put it into your slot one, right? Then you'll come up here and you'll buy the next most expensive apartment. You'll buy that, so pop that in there. Right, you come back again. Now, sometimes I just click on that high to low. Now, I always like having the most expensive apartments, so I'll buy that one. And I'll just fill up the slots. I'll just fill up the slots. So we'll just go high to low, purchase property. We'll go high to low again. Purchase property. High to low. Purchase property. High to low again. Purchase property. And just keep doing this, all right? But leave the last slot. Don't do anything to the last one, all right? Just leave the last one there. Just don't do anything to that. All right, and I'll show you why in a minute. Okay, so we're gonna go purchase property and we're gonna leave the last one there. We're gonna leave the last one. We're not gonna touch it, okay? Now you can buy into the last one if you want actually, you can, okay, but we're gonna lose it. We're gonna lose it, so it's not gonna matter. All right, the only way to get this to save fully without losing any money, okay? I'm gonna show you guys now. Right, so obviously the main reason I'm doing this, okay, I wanna use the casino, all right? I wanna use the casino, but I wanted to make the apartments um, in this video. What I'm currently doing is I'm buying items inside of the casino using casino chips. And you can also use this for casino chips as well. You know, if you don't wanna lose your casino chips and you wanna keep them, you know, you can use this method. If you wanna buy stuff in the casino for, um, gender swap unlocks or whatever you know pieces of clothing or anything like that so um, i'm just going to come over here i think it's here fitted suit jackets i'm just going to buy all these you know and the more chips you have the better like the longer time you're going to get before your money runs out you know you're going to be able to purchase more stuff but um for me like i only have like one mil so you know it's going to run out very very quickly <laughs> um but you know, you're not losing anything. You're not losing anything by doing this. You're not losing any money whatsoever. Or like, even though the chips are going down, my console, my other console still has the, those chips online. Right, so as you can see, we don't have enough. Right, we don't have enough. So we're after buying a good little bit there. So what I'm gonna do now is just go appearance, and I'm just gonna change my style, change my outfit. And you'll see that I'll get an orange save circle down the bottom right-hand corner, right? Now what I'm gonna do is go back to story mode. Right, so we switch over to the other console here, our Xbox One that is currently locked with Netcut. And as you can see, we're still online here. We're still online inside of the casino. We still have the chips that we started off with. We still have the money that we started off with. All right. So now what I want to do is obviously I want to save the apartments, don't I? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go here and I'm going to go... Um, Let's say low to high. Now, what I always recommend buying the apartment that might be about, I think it's like, you know, about 65,000, this one, all right? And just buy that into your last slot, your last slot here. Just buy it in here, all right? You're gonna obviously get a bit of money or whatever, all right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually trade that in, right? You just basically wanna make an adjustment. So I'm just gonna trade that in here, right? And then I'm just gonna buy it again. So I'll go here 80,000 or whatever, right? And we buy it into the last slot so that we get minus, all right? The money goes minus, all right? And all you wanna do then is obviously um, get an ammo save, you know, purchase some ammo if you can. And what we'll do is we'll go into the casino to make an adjustment to our casino chips. That's what I'm going to do now. Right, I'll go into the casino. And I'll make a save by making an alteration to my casino chips. Now, obviously, I'm on the Xbox One, guys, so it takes a bit longer to actually load into the casino. All right. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to go over here. 
I'm just going to play one of the slots. It don't matter if you win or lose. It doesn't matter. All you want to do is just make a small adjustment to your chips. Right, so we lost. So we're just going to exit. And we're going to force another game save by just changing our outfit here. All right. Right. So we just change the outfit. Get an orange save circle. Back to story mode. And now what we'll do is we'll go back to our Koi router. And as you can see, the console is actually still locked. Now, the second I click unlock, it's going to kick me off the game on the Xbox One. It's going to kick me off the game straight away. So I'm going to go back to the game here. And you see it's after kicking me back to the dashboard, the home screen. So we want to click on play here instead. All right, and what's going to happen is once you're loading the game, you're going to get an option between do you want to load a save from the console or do you want to load a save from the cloud? Okay, you want to load that save from the cloud. It's very, very important that you load the save from the cloud and not the one from the console. All right, cloud, over to the right, cloud. Load that save. And what's going to happen is when we come back online, you're going to notice that we'll have the money that we started off with We'll also have the casino chips we started off with, and you will also have the apartments that you bought. You'll have those apartments as well. And then what you will do is you will just trade those apartments in. Go basically, uh, lo go to low to high, and just buy the cheapest apartments, replace all the slots, and then just get the money and then go and do Beth again and then buy the most expensive apartments again and rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat. And I'm telling you one thing, if you spent a day doing that, you'd have a hundred fucking million in no time. I'm telling you now, I've done it before. I spent about seven hours doing it. I had like fucking 80 or 90 fucking million. This is an effective way to make money. It will always be there. The car sales, Rockstar came along and they made adjustments to selling cars so you can only get 100% of the sale value for your first vehicle sale after that the value drops down so selling cars as of right now is just not worth your while okay it's just not worth your while if you want to make easy money pick yourself up a little cheap console you know an xbox one if you're playing xbox a cheap ps4 if you're on playstation you know this thing is very very efficient you'll always have money on this game and you can also merge cars, you can do a lot of stuff. A ton of stuff. You know, so obviously guys, I'm on the Xbox One, as I've said, you know, the load times are a killer on the Xbox One. They are a killer. They take so long to load. You know, the game is just crazy. But um, I had a lot of people uh, requesting that I make a video showing them how to do Beth and how to like basically get money on this game and stuff like that. So I really hope this video is helpful to some of you, you know. Now you can do this with a friend as well. If you have a friend of yours, you know, you can just lock your console and leave your console online and then just tell your friend to sign into your account. So what you would do is like you load the game up and you get Arcoy router and you would lock your console once you are online. So you lock the console and then you'd say to your friend, oh yeah, my console is locked. And then your friend would sign in. Your friend will buy the most expensive apartments and then he'll force a game save and um, he'll go back to story mode and then he will tell you that he's done after making a save. And then what you would do then is basically just do what I done, uh, buy some ammo, buy a, a cheap like maybe 80,000 or something apartment into your last slot force a game save again and then go back to story mode and then what you would do is you just unlock the console just unlock the console it should kick you off the game and tell you that the the, the game is launched on another console what you want to do then is just start the game up and load the cloud save and once you load back in you should have everything that you started with so we're loading in here currently now right and you're going to notice that I have the chips, I have the money I started with, right? If I go here and I go to Dynasty, you'll notice that I'll have the most expensive apartments. So if I go load the hoy and I go to purchase a property, I can sell any of these for money. Now, obviously, I don't want to do that. But as you can see, the last slot is very, very important, okay? The last slot. 
do not buy into that all right you need to buy into that on your second console okay the second console you buy into the last slot and you will never lose money if you do that okay you'll never lose money all right you will never lose money if you do it that way so um yeah guys that's basically it for the video i really hope you all did enjoy it's been your boy hutchie hd and i'm out bye bye